This is it. We're here. This is Crapopolis. I swear it's not as bad as the name sounds. Ah! All that looked. I bet he deserved it. Fisherman, your king returns. We have a king? <laughs> We're a democracy, so him not knowing me means I'm crushing it. Oh, wow. And here's my family to greet us. I guess you guys heard. Heard? That I fought a kraken, rescued a princess, and I'm returning with a girlfriend. Am I rushing it? No, I'm his girlfriend. <laughs> Yeah, it's the talk of the town. I've got two grilled octopus and two coconut waters. That's us. What do we owe you? Three sandals, so you're only here for food. In our defense, we got hungry and forgot you were gone. Can you break a chicken? Do I look like I carry seven buckets of olives? Hey, girlfriend, welcome to Crap oh. We need your sandals. We are good for it. We're royalty. Deliria demands this story continue. Yes, Mother. Fifth time you've interrupted to say that. And I was tied to the rock, and the Kraken was going to eat me. Mm. But then Tyrannus arrived and rescued me. You rescued me. You rescued me. Huh? You fought a Kraken. With what? My fist. Punched it on the nose. I guess that's their weakness. That's sharks. Well, turns out nobody likes it. Horophily, Tyrannus tells me you're a sea nymph. Would we know your family? Well, my father is Poseidon. Oh, very impressive. Oh, so when my son chooses the daughter of a god, it's romantic. But, but when your mother chooses, it's gross. Yeah, you're getting it. Come on. You know what I'm not getting? This cracking story. Don't be jealous of your brother, Stupendous. He can barely swim. How do you untire in the water? Krakens are bad with knots. Once again, that's sharks. I am bleeding to death. That can wait. How is this a feasible combination? That's Tyrannus's girlfriend. Oh, well, I'm his half-brother, which I guess makes us husband and wife if he gets murdered. You were bleeding to death? Yeah, because guess which animal still refuses to roll over for civilization? Wolves. Wolves. Wolves! <laughs> What is with this rivalry between humans and wolves? They're the only animal we will never be friends with. I'm just going to say it right now, they're man's worst enemy. Mm -hmm. Brilliant. That's going to mm -hmm. stick. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You realize this poor young lady is sitting here like a prop. Can we please give her a bit of agency? Herophily, I'd like you to decide when you're marrying my son. Mom, we just met. Her father is Poseidon. He's going to propose to you before sundown. Here's why. You're the hottest woman I'll ever have a shot at. This family is the wolves of people. I guess the legend of our relationship is spreading now. I can't believe the king's not going to die a virgin. Inappropriate, but hopefully true. And there's where people eat, and there's where they poo. Those places are really close together. That's exactly what I said. You're good at this. Look, we're on a vase. Being in a celebrated relationship feels extra romantic, doesn't it? I guess that's why we should put extra effort into knowing where we're at, keeping it real. That's smart. I agree. Your divine royalnesses. I made a sculpture of you two meeting. <gasps> Holy balls. Marry me. Yes! <laughs> They're getting married! Mostly because of my work! Wolves. They're smart. Yet savage. Organized. Yet impulsive. Not unlike man. Schlub, if you start with that man is just an animal crap, I will pin you to the floor and dominate you with a non-sexual hump. And that's why you're the Cyclops for this mission, sis. This new technology will allow you to walk among wolves, perceived as one of their own. Is that a tank of wolf pee? Is that a problem? You calling me scared? I will non-sexually hump you. Kids, kids, there's no need to fight. We'll all get our chance in the... Tank. Then let's begin!
now that we're friends, what do you say we visit your leader? <laughs> My mother will be so happy we're getting married, which I don't even see as a downside now. And I'm so happy that I'm not even turned off by how much you mention her. I guess I do fixate too much on proving her wrong. She represents the old world, and I never saw a role for myself in it. Then I punched a kraken. I'm a kraken puncher. Yeah, you are. Is that a... is that a kraken? Oh, God. Oh, dear God. Do you think it's the same one? Do I just punch it again? I don't know. Well, get behind me, I guess. Or should we run? I don't know. If we run, will you still love me? I think so. Oh, that God. Run! Oh! You run and you're dead! Oh, damn it. Where's your mother? She stiffed me! See? I'm not the only one who brings her up. Wait, what? Excuse me? What are you saying? His mother owes me 20 cows for the fake Kraken fight. You're not a real Kraken. Real Kraken, Jagoff. Fake fight. <laughs> I'm hungry, and I'm not going away. Sorry about the language, sweetie. I respect Poseidon a lot. Your dad's what Krakens call a Krakens god. Oh, and congratulations. <laughs> I heard you guys got engaged. Thank you. Thank you. And Delirious Son fought a Kraken and won Because he's Delirious Son. Loving it. And Poseidon's daughter called out from the water. Okay, but Poseidon can have his own song. What if that's where you put a catchy hook, like... This is the wedding of Delirious Son. Delirious, Delirious. I love that idea. I'll come up with some lyrics. I just gave oh. you the lyrics. Manipulator. Ugh, who talked? The Kraken. What happened to the crew? Did they drown? I turned them into fish when they hit the water, brought them home, and set them up with wives of their own. Unlike you, they won't be complaining. Do you mind? No problem. I mean, leave the room. Don't talk to my bard like a slave. You leave and you die. No problem. I thought I was in love. You are. And she's quite taken with you, oddly enough. But if the blabbermouth Kraken changed that, we'll just sweeten the deal for her. I don't want her to get a deal. I've told you my whole life I don't want to be provided with a woman. Yes, yes, you want to earn a woman by giving her more things than someone better looking. It's quite modern, son. But we've given it a go. I can't make another child. You were too much work. You owe me a grand son worthy of overthrowing you. Well, now I can die the world's most satisfied virgin since I'll finally be depriving you of something. Maybe I should go. No! no I'm going. I have a princess to return. So sorry I tried to help you. If there were anyone in this entire world that wanted your help, Mother, you'd be ruining their life instead of mine. This is the wedding of delirious. Spiders! Oh, God, why? Are they poisonous? They're not biting. They're everywhere. Can I just ask why? I'll take that as a no. Whatever I did, I'm sorry. So many spiders. Am I allowed to kill them? I'm killing a lot of them just by flailing. If that's some kind of test, I can try to stand still. I'll do anything. I'm so sorry for whatever I did to offend you. I have to get out of these clothes. You know, your son does seem pretty mad at you. I'm not doing any actual navigating, by the way. I'm just moving this thing around. Where do you live again? The ocean. We're here. Sorry, I'm not a real kraken puncher. I didn't like you for that. I liked that you wanted to be free from the gods. And here I am, dumping you back with Poseidon. And then going back to Deliria. Gods, they think they're so high and mighty, but they're, well, they're high and mighty, but they're the ones that need us. It would serve them right if you and I just... Disappeared? I know a place we could live free. It's called... The swamp. The gods never go there. Unless the swamp is a special name for a place that isn't a swamp. I don't think anyone goes there. Well, it's a swamp, but it's a swamp we control. We could have a kingdom there. And kids. <laughs> we could try, which I hear is the best part. And then the kids are... Let's do it, Tyrannus. Let's try it. Let's swamp it. You really mean it? I really mean let's try. Mm. Oh, whoa. 
Hi, everybody. Two wolves approaching. I'll be living with you guys, learning your secrets. Not that they're secrets to me. I'm a wolf. Is that your boss? What'd he say? Something good? Huh? That'll keep the rain out. I guess the floor got kind of... Swamped? Exactly. Hungry? I'm going to check on the frog trap. I may not know how to trap frogs. But we're free. Right. And now we have to stay free forever or I'll be killed. Oh boy, get behind me. I need a weapon. I need a stick. Great, now I'm a master frog catcher. Carrots? Herophily. Oh, who are you? Her boyfriend. I see. I'm heartbroken, but I'm not the jealous type. You don't have to be. You have a horse penis. I'm jealous. What's the story here? Carrots was my first love. He left me. Well, I had to flee from your father. I ended up on a tiny island imprisoned by irresistible centaur women. Women with the backs and fronts of horses. After a year, I realized, wait, these are just horses, so I left. And I remembered how you used to talk about the swamp. Can we go back to the year you spent banging horses? I could have lied about that part. That's definitely true. I didn't come here to get you back. I'll believe it when I see it. I'm just hiding from your dad. Us too. Yeah, us too. The couple moving into her swamp. Good luck out there, carrots. Tyrannus, he'll die. I said good luck. Uh, Carrots, please do me the honor of living in a swamp with me and your ex-girlfriend. I appreciate that. I'm saying this right now. You're both dicks if you fall back in love. And I don't care if my ugly possessiveness makes it feel romantic. It won't be. It'll be a dick move that got called ahead of time. Perfectly reasonable. No, that makes sense. <sighs> I'm not wounded. I'm just in this position because it's badass. I should get back! Ugh. You making fun of me? You bring one more stick to me and see what happens. Thanks for bringing all those sticks. I assume this is like a truce. So I'm going to lay down and either heal or die. And I'll kill you in the morning. Hunger. Uh, hungry, hungry, hunger. Eating. Food. Yes, come on. This game was supposed to take our minds off starvation. <laughs> Don't cry, Herophily. We still have one more round. We can come back. I pray to my father. What? what? Okay, you can cry now. Cry hard. You just killed us. I'm sorry. I didn't know I'd be on the hook for everyone's misery. Now you're on the hook for our deaths. Okay, this is good, though. If we're all being honest, I hate the swamp and I want my mummy. What are you doing? My mum gave me an emergency ritual. Some moss, a uh, good-looking rock, a mud. Gonna just... This looks like my mum, I think, right? You're spending uh, a lot of time on the breasts. You don't get to judge family dynamics. Goddess Deliria, mother of the ungrateful. Goddess Deliria, mother of the ungrateful. My father is coming. Shh! Goddess Deliria, mother of the ungrateful. This is the Goddess Deliria. Yes, yes, mum. I'm sorry, and I need you just to... If you'd like to leave a sacrifice, you can do so after this message. If not, lose this ritual. Frog! Frog! Give me the frog! Dolphin's keys! I hope you're happy. This brackish water is killing these guys. Yeah, you're fine now, but trust me. I'm sorry, Dad. I, I don't want to hear it. Daddy's here. This ends now. You're getting married. Where are these jackasses? Get over here. You, horse ass. What's your name? Gravy? Carrots. I don't want to hear it. And you, your delirious kid, Titmouse? Yes. That's your name? Titmouse? No. Tell me your name. Tyrannus. I don't want to hear it. Here's how it's going to go down. I don't care who marries her at this point. One of you is. The other one is dying. Dad, no. Don't make me choose. I'm not. You choose wrong. At dawn, the two of you fight to the death. For my amusement. But more importantly, to uphold it. No, no. For my amusement. These dolphins are dying! 
Yes, you are. Dying dolphin skis. Sorry. Sorry. I'm sorry, guys. You're sorry. Should I not be? I was more expressing like, sorry doesn't begin to cover it. We're blaming me for this. Well, you did bring me to a secret swamp where your ex-boyfriend lives and then brought your father to the secret swamp, so I'm not going to blame the crocodiles. We were going to die. You guys were. I eat grass. I was surviving. Now you're surviving and one of us isn't. And to be clear, whichever of us does survive will always agree with the dead one that you could have handled this better. Gee, I can't wait to be forced to marry the most lethal of two men that despise me. Uh, <laughs> is that funny? No, but it is funny to pick this moment to expect our sympathy. Yeah, cry us a river. Cry us a swamp. Look, don't worry. Carrots and I have a plan. Poseidon might not even show up. Are you serious? Sometimes he makes people stand around all day and that's the lesson. I love that lesson. Yep, let's get out of here. Time to fight to the death! Damn it. You should stay in my room until my family can get used to you. But I walk around a lot. You like walking around? And after a while, maybe our species can form some kind of... Attention, wolves! Withdraw or die! Friendship. You are no match for humanity! You have yet to develop the sound cone! Okay, time to fight. To the death. And don't do the thing where you're friends so you're conflicted about fighting. Just really go at each other. Now! Mm. You're mm. doing the exact thing I asked you not to do! Mm. Fight for real! Stop! We can be friends! This wolf and I slept together! <laughs> oh, grow up! That's sweet, sis, but I don't think these wolves understand. Wolf, you can understand me, right? <laughs> okay, great! I'll talk to my army and you translate for yours. Listen to me! Humans and wolves are not that different! We're smart, but violent! We're especially mean to our own kind. Maybe we finally found the one animal that really gets us. friends with wolves. Stop! We won't fight anymore. And here's why. We have something you don't have. <laughs> Integrity! Carrots! Are you satisfied? Have you seen enough blood? No. I haven't seen any. I can't believe you guys tried to pull the fake telescoping spear trick. Okay, okay. Caught us there. You do understand now I had to kill you both. Of course it makes a lot of sense that this would offend you. And you know why? Because the lesson is nobody likes to be manipulated. He gets it. He's nodding. No, no. I was imagining a kick-ass song to murder you by... Dun, 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 die! Die, 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 die! die! But I think if you think... Let it out. Let's go. I hate you. Yeah, yeah. You coming home, or do you want to keep being free? I'll come home, but I hate you. Dolphins! Dolphins? See? Called it. Already dead. Whale! Well! I'll move is one. Order is air. All right, you're human and he's gone. Did it work? Of course it worked. It's not like Poseidon's going to choose now to become unpredictable. Can I just ask, Mum, whose dismembered human and horse appendages those are? Actually, you can't ask, because the lesson here is never question my judgment. I'm good with that lesson. I'm Carrots. No new friends, Carrots, and find your own way home. You're a good guy, Carrots the Centaur, and a good horse, combined. We haven't seen the last of each other, King Tyrannus. Yeah! <laughs> 
says ya to himself. Haven't seen the last of each other. Like he gets to decide how enduring a character he is. Oh, centaurs. Centaurs. Mum, you were right. I can't keep being so critical of you if I'm just as much of a spoiled ass face. Yes, yes, it's possible. It was unfair of me to trick you. Right, what animal do you want to go home on? An eagle. You don't get to choose. Tricked you? Whale! Inspired choice. He didn't invent summoning whales. How's it going? Well, they are interested in a domestic relationship. That's great. I don't know. They want to live in our houses and sleep in our beds and eat our food. But they want to be escorted outside so they can poop and pee wherever they want. And whenever they do it, they want to be told they're good at it. Okay, that took a turn. What are they offering us? Can we milk them? No. No milking, no hauling. Look, I'm a very interspecies kind of guy. But this is the most one-sided proposal I've ever heard. And I can't advise mankind to do anything else but walk the hell away. You guys, look at their offspring. It's like their puppies are intentionally becoming cuter. Yeah, but the negotiations aren't really... Okay, look at this little guy. Are you a little guy? Yes, you are. Just go in there and agree to everything. Stop being a jerk. Did you 